In August of this year, we decided to take a break to the Southern Rockensburg. Instead of using the reindeer, we decided to support one of the local tour operators, operating out of the town of Underberg. This turned out to be a great option, as this left us to enjoy the magnificent views the mountain and pass has to offer. Driving to the border control and getting through was quick and easy. And soon after the border control, we would be in no man's land. And this is where we start filming. Even though the land cruiser rocked and was noisy, it did not take away from the excitement of the journey going up to Sony. This was my wife's first time up, and you could see it left an impression with her. That would be remembered for a long time afterwards. The border control into the city was another quick effort and without incident. Pass was in a fairly good condition and would easily be done in any 4x4 vehicle with ground clearance. But today we didn't have to worry about gear selection and gradients. We could sit back, relax and enjoy the views. These Land Cruisers were extended chassis models with three rows of seats. Our company was full and we shared the journey with tourists from the UK. A good bunch of people with interesting banter all the way from the town of Underberg and back.
It is always surprising how our beautiful country is sometimes better appreciated by others rather than ourselves. The tour guide was also knowledgeable and friendly. A gentleman that has been doing this for longer than 12 years. He knows every rock in that pass, he states. And I believe him. As the convoy snicked its way up to the top, you could feel the change in elevation and temperature. Soon we would see our first frozen waterfall. The tour guide states that it's frozen like this right throughout the listen to winter.
Soon we would summit at the top with the highest pub in Africa on our right. We did have lunch there before going back. The food was under average and overpriced, but at least the beer was cold. Going up the pass was a beautiful experience and I'm glad I could share it with my wife. It was cold and uh, remember in the proper rainy and winter times, this pass will be more of a daunting task. If you do want to experience the pass and maybe perhaps you don't have a high rise 4 4 vehicle, but you still want to see the beauty and magnificence of the Sony please consider using one of the tour operators in Underberg. They were friendly, they got us up the pass safe and down as well. And um, they're quite knowledgeable, so support the locals.